what I've got. And this is what I'm left with. This is what I'm working on so far. Took all the uh, old metal off, the rust. Cleaning it all up. Hopefully this hole will be gone soon. Vacuumed in there. Cleaned it all out. I'll bring you back when I got a bit further. Just rust treated it now. Just waiting for the truck, the rust to work. So, let that do its job. And then I've got a piece of metal that's going to go down into there. Oh, that's my next job. So, I've vacuumed and cleaned all in there. Obviously I can't get to the bits in there until I take the scuttle off. But in the meantime, I can get rid of the get on with the actual um bulkhead. I haven't been bringing so many videos out lately because I'm trying to get an actual job more or less completed before I show you. So I'm not showing you the same things over and over again. So this is it so far. I'll get back to you when I've done some more. This is this is the panel that's going in next. I made with the round indent on the top. So that's where I'm going so far. And this is where it's going. On there, it's all primed, cleaned, rust treated. It's going on there. And then it'll be lining up down there. <coughs> really getting a move on now. I'm only going to be coming up so far though because in here I've got to take this inner wing off to get all in there. There's no point in going too far. Yeah. All up here. Oh, I'll bring it back when I've uh, made some improvement. Well, get moving. <laughs> I've now got a bulkhead. I've used a bit of filler to cover the wilds. Grinded the wilds down, used a bit of filler. I'm just sanding it now. So, yeah. It's all solid. Get back to you when I've done some more. I've even done this bit here. He's done his hand till we've turned it up some more. Nice new piece in that. That's it for today. I hate sanding. I'll finish sanding that tomorrow. But I got all of this as well. I just gotta continue it on across there. But I've got to remove all this to go under there. But into the point in doing that for now. But it is solid. It ain't going anywhere. I've even braced it behind there on the inside. The eater boxes and what the eater stuff all fits in perfectly and lines up. So, nearly there, not much left now. Just sanding and primering. I've got work all behind the boxes, all behind there as well. Looking good. as well but again I can't do that until I take the scuttle panel off 
under that filler there, there is metal indents that fall all the way down. I've just got to finish sanding it so I can see it. And I've got to cut the rest of this lip off at the bottom so I can fold this round like the original. Get in there. I just hate sanding and border sanding. Now that that's in, I can jet wash the engine. with this now there is supposed to be an indent here but I don't think I'm gonna put it in because it would hold water like a swimming pool so I might leave it like that don't know yet I might put it in because it probably still old the water probably run down there Round there and down here. Just like if the water was down here, it should run down here and down there. show you how far I've gone. Everything fixes, fits as it should, even the eater box. I've tested it and bolted it in and it all fits. And all the pipe works all fit, lovely. Just a bit of clean up and then this bit's done. Right, I'll see you in the next video. Please like and subscribe. Thank you for watching.